A potential breakthrough in the fight against Lyme disease. That's right. Researchers say they found a set of biomarkers that could help make diagnoses earlier. Here's Chris Welch with the details. It's really big news. It, it's really a, a transformative discovery. Scientists are now closer than ever before to creating a diagnostic test for Lyme disease. Dr. Timothy Salati is with the nonprofit Global Lyme Alliance. It's really important because it is a very difficult disease to diagnose. Lyme disease is a bacterial infection transmitted through the bite of a tick. But the symptoms that can develop are similar to those of other illnesses like COVID, the flu, multiple sclerosis, and chronic fatigue syndrome. A misdiagnosis can lead to an infection that lasts for years. Causing more and more damage until effective treatment is provided to the patient. We don't really understand the disease. But it may finally be getting less confusing. And that is thanks to the work of Dr. Avi Ma'ayan and his research colleagues at Mount Sinai's Icon School of Medicine. They've determined that a person's gene expression, the way a person's genes show up in the blood, can diagnose long-term Lyme disease. And we could detect that genes that are known to be associated with an immune response are upregulated. That means that they are highly expressed. And essentially what they've done is they have identified a set of genes that allow them to diagnose uh, post-treatment Lyme disease syndrome or chronic Lyme disease patients. The real world result, a diagnostic test for Lyme disease. It wouldn't be 100% accurate, but pretty close. It will be high probability that you have it. It will be in the 90 and 90th percent. And that test, he says, could be available one or two years from now. Chris Welch, Fox 5 News.